five star treatment from our bear this weekend. Uh, yeah. We're at the wrong hotel. Oh man, Dom. How long have you worked for our bear? Why did you choose me and Todd? <laughs> Look at that colour. Cerakote. Cade Muir. We're going up and up and up. Bumbling our way down. Oh, <laughs> Whoa. Some lines here, isn't there? I can't believe how different all the tracks are up here. Yo! <laughs> oh. It's literally a bit of everything. Yo, guys, it is the Tweed Love International this weekend, which is sponsored by Orbea. So we've got some entries, uh, but Todd is currently in Greece on his first him and his girlfriend holiday. So his entry has gone to Sunny. Alright. Alright. So what's happening is we are having proper five star treatment from our bear this weekend. So tonight, which is Thursday night, we're heading up and we are staying in I think it's called the McDonald Court Court Drover or something hotel. And then we've got uh, two nights in the People's Hydro and these are both proper plush hotels. So, yeah, we've been really looked after. I mean, this is proper sponsorship stuff. I'm absolutely buzzing. Um, the Rocky has sort of won't turn on. A bit like my missus. And... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, basically, I'm lending in Todd's e-bike, the full fat, the wild. So we are both in seeded e-bike category. So let's get over and check out our posh hotel. We have arrived. First things first, gin and tonic. Uh, yeah. Right, so this is the week, first balls up of the weekend. <laughs> we stayed for a drink at the McDonald's. Dom, Dom from Orbea has rang me and uh, <laughs> tried to get in the spinny door. We're at the wrong hotel. We're at this one tomorrow night and the next night, but tonight we're at the uh, People's Hydro. So let's go to the right hotel. Here we are, at the correct hotel. We are now in the correct place, People's Hydro, and we have met old man Dom. Good evening. And uh, let me just explain. Dom is our connection, our man, old Bayer. How long have you worked for old Bayer? Just over 18 months now. The big question is, why did you choose me and Todd? <laughs> Tough question. Uh, because prior to me starting in Kettlebell in the yeah. UK, we weren't really doing anything for the core mountain bike audience, yeah. the proper mountain bikers. Yeah. Um, ones that aren't just watching GMBN. Yeah. They aren't um, just engaging with the live events yeah. and the big events like Red Bull Rampage, Hardline, as well as um, the Daniel series. So we really need to do something to connect with the audience at yeah. that level. Yeah, sound. And uh, to commend you from us and yeah. just to tell our subscribers, definitely the best, best brand to work with yeah. and the Thanks most you. reliable person we've ever worked with Thank by you. a long bloody way um so yeah i'm not going to smoke blow smoke up your <laughs> ass anymore um, but yeah, thank you for the awesome treatment we're, that we're looking forward to this weekend. Thanks very much, Jim. Pleasure. Especially with our stand-in Todd. He's, he's got a bit older. <laughs> uh, he's quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, but he's on Todd's bike, so it's okay. Morning. his pocket today so one of the things that this people's hydro is uh, kind of well known for is they've got like the leisure center with all the water stuff you know swimming sauna etc let's go check it out hard work is fighting Mark <laughs> Instantly 
we are feeling suitably refreshed and awake. Time to go and uh, pack our stuff up because we're at the McDonald. What's it tonight? And then go and have a look right at hotel. Yeah, have a look at them setting up in uh, Peebles. So we're leaving this room tonight, and Dom's staying here, and we're going over to the McDonald. But we're going to leave him a little surprise in the bed, make him think there's a human in there when he walks in, freak him out. So either Dom or the cleaner will come in here and. <laughs> Look at that. It does look that real. <laughs> so guys, in a leaf and high street. You've got the bike shop up there, which is owned by our friend Gordo. And now he has a new restaurant called Out Out. Out Out. We're uh, we've met him for a pizza and we're gonna come here tonight and have a meal. So if you want a decent food, get yourself out to Out Out. Right, so we've come up and we're parked around, parked around the back of the Peebles Hydro. Got the special finger there. Can you see it? On many a funny photo. And uh, bikes wise, I'm on the Pink Demon. Um, no real changes, except the pedals, which the colour match wasn't quite right. They've been sent off to Cerakote and he's going to match the colour, but they're going to go pink. And that's about it, nothing else on the bike is new. And Sonny is on Todd's Eeb. Uh Just fitted a downhill tyre and a liner, which has gone down twice, so hopefully we'll have no problems with that today. It just needs riding, I think, just to settle it in. So let's see what Sonny thinks of these Maven brakes. I've actually canceled the order of mine because I think they're too powerful. Dom is here. For those of you who don't know, you probably won't know, but a lot of you know Al Bond from racing, doing hard lines and stuff like that. Dom is his brother. And this is his, look at that color. Very similar to the team bikes actually. Are the team bikes black and gold? Uh, or white and gold? Black and outside, I think. So yours is nearly there. Yeah. I like that. So just want to give a shout out again, I mentioned him before, to James at Cerakote uh, by JWS. He has done Todd's pedals, these are make of these deity Todd loves these so these are all scratched and like a red anodized so now he's done them in like a purple Cerakote and they're pretty cool I got the special Timu um, fast house overalls on today hopefully it's not gonna rain I can't be asked for the waterproof it's quite warm we are Peebles OBS and we are gonna go and try and find somewhere that we haven't ridden before. So basically up the high street and up on the left, apparently there's some tracks. This village, because uh, Sonny's got a loose crank from Todd's usual, usual bolt checking. We've got a creek, and we can't be starting off a ride with a loose crank. Creek sorted, it was just the crank needed cranking up. You have to do them pretty tight. So we're heading up the fire road, and this place is actually called Cade Muir. Never been here before, we're going past lots of tracks and uh, just trying to find out actually how you get to the top. So we were expecting this to be a little hill and we're going up and up and up. You want to go first Dominique? Right, here we go. We've had a bit of rain up here. Whoa, I saw that then. That slammed your back end round. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> my arms are soaked. Oh that's better. Got about a million choices. Anyone local will be laughing at us watching as we're bumbling our way down with no clue where we're going. Whoa, oh my God, this needs some maintenance. <laughs> Someone needs to get up here with a, with a head trauma. Oh, my arm's going numb. Nice, that's what you want. On a trail you've never ridden. Oh, oh my God, soaked and my arm's gone completely numb. <laughs> You're soaking. Absolutely drenched. <laughs> I bet you weren't that bad, were you? Because we knocked oh, no. all the water off. 
So where we have come from, if I zoom in, there she is, that's the Peebles Hydro. Onwards and downwards, I don't think we're going back up there again. A bit uh, overgrown, we probably missed a good trail that's not overgrown. I do without all these puddles, I've got to put my goggles on, one that realised there's a, there's a branch hit my face. Well, you can tell he's uh, Al Bond's brother, not hanging about. Nice corner. That's obviously just been fixed. Oi! <laughs> Dodgy off camera roots there. That's a bit better, isn't it? How do them pedals feel? What do you think of those pedals? Yeah, sound. Like them. Into Trail Forks. That was called Penfold. Yeah, yeah. And then we've got another one here. I'll follow you this time, Sonny, if you want to follow Dom. Sonny's hunting down. Oh my god. <laughs> 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 oh, I was not expecting that. <laughs> ah, I'm stuck. Ah. Right, you alright? Yeah, I'm alright. No, no damage. Very rutty, isn't it? Nice. See, once I've done one run, my hand's kind of all right, my arm. It's really weird. Nice. Yo. <laughs> Yo. So on trail forks, this one looks like it's shut, but we're gonna have a look. Look, we've got some big trees down. my goggles on. Of course honey, try and keep up with you this time. Not riding like a vag. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, more like it. Yeah. Whoa, that was a fair G out on the bottom of there, wasn't it? I like that bit where your back end slid along that route. So we're just riding up the fire road and trying to tick off trails. No idea. Next one up. It's raining. Oh, that's a bit nasty on the pedal. Oh, nice. This brakey noise is coming up. Whoa! Better, isn't it? Watch that rock! <laughs> That's pretty cool, not as good as the last one. Last one was better, wasn't it? <laughs> Don't go fun. You kicked a massive rock up and it sat in the middle of a berm. Go for it while I haven't got rain on my goggles. Right. Whoa! They are, aren't they? Wow! Some lines here, isn't there? Oh my god, I'm not sending that. Maybe with a bit of pracky. Nice! Wow! Definitely the best one yet. Whoa, that's a big step down. Wow, that's the best track yet, isn't it? Yeah. Be good to know that. Next one up. Come on. Whoa! Jesus. There's lots and lots of scary off camber bits, like roots on off cambers. You've got to kind of bounce around. Wow. 
definitely tricky so good to come up here and actually ride something I haven't done before <laughs> oh my god wow this one's tri tricky oh my god this one's difficult rough isn't it that wow there is another one off the very very top that comes down the side that's been felled let's do that then so then you can go up to the top do that down and then go into the first one there and then down yeah yeah so do three tracks tidy yeah. motor yeah. right here we go right back at the top can we get down and keep things dry oh my god that was a bit savage straight away no nor me oh we're a bit exposed God. Wow. Okay. Come on, catch up. Oh, this is like the avalanche one that's at inners a bit. It's like steeper and scarier. Wow. Oh, this is so different. I can't believe how different all the tracks are up here. Jesus. I bet them brakes are suddenly so good here. Put out Friday. Oh, it actually is Friday as well. Wow. Wow, we. So, Sonny, what are them brakes like? I bet they're amazing down there. They are, yeah. I was pressing hard on mine. And I've had to adjust mine so they're biting on about the last 10 mil. Yeah. So they're not too powerful. Yeah. But they're, they're good. Yeah. They're what a yeah, mixture yeah. of tracks they've I got know, here. So what a place this is. We've had a right mixture. We've had like tight, nagery, rocky, rooty stuff in like fresh pine trees. We've had more open tracks, which are like off camber roots and rocks. And then there's like cut stuff with jumps and drops. And then you had that like sort of shaley avalanche type it's literally a bit of everything yeah i think this is going to be a dodgy one oh my god oh i'm stuck on a tree right can i get going sonny's got it in race motor on the red i think he might regret that down here that looks terrifying. Can't see the ground. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not yet. You still got it in race mode. Yes. You idiot. Yes. Feet still up. Feet still up. I didn't even dab then, Sonny. Can I do it? Still haven't put my feet down. Whoa. Oh, oh no. Oh, god. <laughs> Do you want to do that again? Three more. My arms. Oh god! <laughs> Everyone forgot about that corner. Whoa! He sent it off. Sent it off. Like an Amazon delivery. That was a shit joke, wasn't it? <laughs> oh that's a bit savage at the end i'll let it go for that right sonny's had a daft idea here he's going into this bit fast 
running. We don't know it. We don't know what's coming up. It wasn't that fast. <laughs> oh my God. Oh! Should have gone off that. Oh, I shot it down in the, in the rocks. <laughs> One crap suspension down here. Oh, it's a double. Oh, you're right. Help! <laughs> Wild man. Oh, there we are. Gate to finish. So, folks, that was Cade Muir. What an amazing place. Really enjoyed that. So good to ride somewhere that I've never ridden in Scotland and with a great crew on great bikes. What can go wrong? <laughs> I can say that now, I've finished. So we're heading back now, get the bikes clean, get the people's hydro. So this is, this is Dom's cleaning technique. <laughs> wow, it's immaculate now. <laughs> right, so this is the Codrona McDonald. We've got a double bed. And we've got a bed of tea. I think the bed of tea will be coming out because we don't want to be that comfy again. And then, if you want a round of golf, we can play a round of golf. You wouldn't be bored out of your mind. Yeah, an angry walk. Mind you, we could have a drive with them. Yeah, that'd be that'd fun. Be all right. So we're about to go and meet Gordo for some food at his place. But we've got to uh, put the bikes on charge. There we go, guys. This is the All Bayer Executive Lounge. Laurie has joined us. Sunnington. How good is this food? Isn't it? Amazing. Right then, guys. Time for me to hit the sack. I hope you liked this video. It was great to get out up there today. What a fantastic place. Really enjoyed it. And thanks to Hospitality uh, in Out Out of Gordo. Highly recommend that. Absolutely beautiful food. So next time you're in a, in a leaf and head over there. Um, yeah, don't forget to check out our affiliates where you've got stuff like the Torque Energy stuff, which is lovely. Um, the stashed rails and various other things you can get cheaper. So go and head on down, get buying. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one where I'm going to do one vlog on practice and racing of the international and the tracks tomorrow. Cheers, keep it pinned.